So Sheraton Grand in Chicago, that's where we're at. And we're gonna try and do one of those like room look tours because I got these little nuggets who are super excited to be here. So let's see. Ooh, a little aggressive there with the, the room. Okay. So let's let them go exploring and let's take a look. So it's a cute little room. I mean, it's exactly what you would expect a basic room to be because I'm poor, but all right, Shot Town views, man. Oh, this is so cool. All right, so what do I think right now? The Sheraton Grand Hotel in Chicago. Fine, great place. Um, Check-in process was easy. The lady was super nice. My issue with, um, so what I did was I paid 20 extra dollars for my hotel room to get unlimited self-parking. Um, so technically my only issue is with self-parking garage. My God, I could not get my car close enough to anything else. Um, luckily I waited for someone to, for a car to pull out next to an Aston Martin. So there was a lot of room, but um, there was no, I wouldn't even maybe get the dogs out of the van if there were, I mean, cause the parking, you were like this close. And I, I was scared I was gonna hit either way. Um, anyway, so that was my only issue right now. Other than that, everything's great. Room's great, service is great, hotel's great. Um, I'm gonna go back down to my car right quick and like get to a, I'm getting a haircut. And with the traffic rate that I experienced coming into the city, I think that I need to leave like right now. So I'm gonna get on the road um, and we'll see what Shot Town has to bring. All right, so forever, for anyone who said that Chicago was a good idea on Memorial Day weekend was an idiot. There, I've been in standstill traffic for like a gosh darn minute. Um, my hair appointment was at 3.15, I left it, it's four miles away. I left at five till three, and now I, it's, it's taking me an hour. It's not taking me an hour, it's ridiculous, but it's taking me a half an hour to go four miles. Um, I don't understand why. I do understand why, it's because it's a major city and there's traffic everywhere and it's garbage, but, and I feel bad, like I made this appointment at this hair place that I saw on TV like eight years ago and if they specialize in men's cuts and like it's supposed to be pretty cool but oh my god is this traffic mess even worth it so i called the guy saying it'd be like five minutes late and now it's like 15 minutes late and this i'm gonna look like a total idiot when i show up chicago get your garbage together on the memorial day weekend i don't need you to have six lanes of traffic closed i need them open so we can go somewhere All right so we're gonna try and do this without everyone staring at me um, let's get out of the way of the window. So the first stop on our tour today was the, I got a haircut at the Chicago Mail Salon in Chicago. Um, it is the first stop on the week long road trip that we are currently taking. I was just waiting for that guy. Um, Chicago Mail, let's see if we can get a good photo of it without them being weird. Chicago Mail. And Chicago in the iconic district of Boys Town in Chicago. Traffic is going to be a nightmare. I came this way, getting back to where we're supposed to be going, but ultimately super fun, super great time. It was really cool to see because I have wanted to come here for a while. I came here when I was a first year medical student. We came for my best friend's wedding and I just took a picture in front of it. But now I got to finally get my hair cut. I saw one of the people that was on the Tabitha episode who was still there. So that was super fun for me. Um, to see behind this car. We're gonna try and figure out where we're going, figure out what to do for the rest of the day, and get the dogs, go for a walk, and take it from there. All right, so we made it down to Navy Pier, but I brought the little doggos with me. So we've just been walking around for a bit. We'll do a full Navy Pier tour here later in a bit, but just kind of letting them do some explorings, get some little smells. They got the fountain up there they were playing in. There's some photo ops over the other way. All right, let's go. Where do you want to go? Gonna go swims. So it's pretty fun. Um, I think they're enjoying themselves a little bit getting all the attention. Everybody wants to pet them. It's cute. They got a picture with a little pee over there. 
Got pictures with the little water towers. So we've been having a fun little time. Got to watch the black one though because she will try and go in the water. So we're not having any of that. Today. All right. Well, right, so we are heading back down to Navy Pier. I don't have the dogs anymore. Um, just kind of doing my own thing. You can sort of see the Chi Town in the background and just kind of, I don't know, they're going to wander out on the Navy Pier and sort of see what we can see. It looks cool, doesn't it? I don't know. I don't know much about Chicago at the end of the day. Um, just kind of here figuring it out by myself. I guess that's the, the theme of the day, by myself. But. It's sad. It's a weird feeling not to have somebody who's been so heavily involved in your life for the past six years that, um, I don't know. But anyway, so we're going to try and make a better night of it. We're going to go down to the Navy Pier. There's a fireworks show at 1030. I don't know really what else there is to do. I'm hoping there's food because I'm starving. All I had was a granola bar today. And um, take it from there. Maybe I'll ride the Ferris wheel. Can you see the Ferris wheel in the background up there? Um... So maybe we'll see what that looks like. That might be cool for some photos down in the, down there. But I don't know, man. Mood's a little, definitely different when you don't have anybody here with you hanging out. Chat town, no gun laws. Broke chickens that now them that's done for. It's a Nicki Minaj lyric about Chat town. So, all right, when we get down, then I find something fun to do. I'll let you know.